Hey, I'm Pastor Fred. Great to have you here. I believe it's Friday, end of the week, uh, follow through. This is the Advent follow throughs. You can kind of tell uh, based on kind of where, where my decorations are at. Uh, we're getting ready for Christmas and, and in a special way, um, we're kind of focusing all of our follow throughs this week and next week and the week after on Advent, getting ready for Christmas. And so hit that subscribe button. Uh, we're going to continue to follow through uh, and to, to live out what God is saying to us in His Word. Um, and, and today I want to talk about Christmas at home. I think it's the theme of every single uh, Christmas movie ever made, right? All, all the Christmas stories. It's about everybody comes home from all the different places, right? All the kids, they come home for Christmas. And it's such a beautiful thing. But, and, and, and it fills our heart with joy and we feel good about life. But, but what if that doesn't happen? Because for a lot of people, it doesn't. For a lot of people, this is not the most wonderful time, but the most lonely time of the year. And, and, and it's for all different reasons. And this year is going to be maybe especially difficult. And so I, I want to call us to, to reach out and to help those who, who might be struggling, who might be going through issues. Right? Maybe they're pushing everyone else away because they don't think they need anybody. But, but we were wired by God to need each other. Right? We need human beings, right? we need to, th them to help us, right? and, and we can be those people for others. And I, and I love this passage from, from Revelation 3, uh, verse 20. Jesus is saying to all of us, He says, Behold, I stand at the door and knock. And so how are we going to respond? Like every day, how are we going to respond? And I, now, again, you, maybe you're not a believer, right? Maybe, maybe you're hearing this and you stumbled upon this and you're like, man, uh, I, I, don't, I don't know who Jesus is. And, and the reality is that he, he wants into your life, into my life, into our lives. And, and he's knocking and he's knocking and he's knocking. And he's saying, come on, open the door, answer the door, stop shutting me out, stop ignoring me, right? Stop pretending you're not home. For, 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 stop pretending that you don't need this. Because he brings us just truth. He brings us love. He brings us peace. He brings us hope, the greatest Christmas gift ever. He gives to us eternal life with him. All our guilt and shame washed away and wiped away. And we are his hope during probably one of the most difficult times we've, we've, that many of us had to go through for a long time is happening right now. And the good news is that Jesus is like, hey, I'm here. I'm here. And if we open the door, he says, and, 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 and he says, I'm going to come in and I'm going to eat with you and you with me. Like, isn't that the most amazing thing? Like, imagine that the Lord of the universe says, hey, well, let's sit down and, and have a bite and have a bite to eat. Because we know that eating, right, when you, when you, when you share that meal, it, it's, a, it's a bonding moment. It's not just about the food. It's about the conversation, isn't it? It's about like you're sharing life at that dinner table, right? When you, when you, when you get together and have, even if it's just coffee, maybe some donuts, a Dunkin' Donuts, like, like you're just, you're doing life together. And what God's saying to us is like as, as a part of your Christmas flow and, and, and your Christmas like routine and what you're doing here. He's like, I, he wants to be the center of it. He wants to be the reason for it. The beginning and the end and everything in the middle. I can't think of anything better for us to know is that that's what he wants to do. See, we often wonder whether he cares. We wonder if he's ever, if he even notices us. But he's saying, no, look, I, I, am, I know where you live and, I, and, I, and, I, and I'm right there. So, so let's, let's not shut him out. But let's welcome him in. N not just that, that time when we believe for the first time, but every day, all the time. Right? Let's just say, yes, Lord, I, 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 I'm not going to exclude you from my schedule. I'm going to put you at the top of my list of everything that I'm going to do. And you're going to be a part of and, 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 and influence and, and permeate everything that I do today. Because that's a day of joy. That's a day of peace. No, regardless of what's happening around you. And that's what I want for you and I want it for your family. I want it for your friends. And so you have an awesome day. 
in the Lord. And uh, we will see you next time for another video follow through.